Binnie Barnes was a formidable actress known for her powerful screen presence and versatility. Born in 1903 in London, Barnes began her career in the 1920s and quickly became a familiar face in British cinema. She later moved to Hollywood, where she continued to make her mark in a variety of roles. Over the course of her career, Barnes appeared in over 100 films, working with some of the biggest stars of the day. She was known for her ability to play a wide range of characters, from comedic roles to dramatic leading ladies. Some of her most memorable films include Werewolf of London, Service Deluxe, and The Golden Fleecing. Barnes was also known for her striking beauty and distinctive voice, which made her a standout on screen. She was a true professional, always prepared and dedicated to her craft. Her talent and hard work earned her the respect and admiration of her peers, as well as a devoted fan base. Despite facing many challenges and obstacles throughout her career, Barnes persevered and continued to work in the industry she loved. She remained active in film and television until her retirement in the 1970s. Today, she is remembered as a trailblazing actress who made a significant contribution to the world of entertainment. Vinnie Barnes was a British actress who appeared in over 60 films during her career, which spanned from the 1930s to the 1970s. She was known for her versatile acting style and ability to play a wide range of characters. Barnes worked with many famous actors and directors, including Bing Crosby, Bob Hope, and Alfred Hitchcock. Vinnie Barnes, a British actress born in 93, had a fascinating background that influenced her successful career in Hollywood. She was born in Islington, London, to a family of vaudeville performers. Her mother, Sarah, was a dancer, and her father, George, was a comedian. This upbringing exposed her to the world of entertainment at a young age. Vinnie's parents encouraged her to pursue a career in show business, and she began performing in their acts as a child. She later attended the Italia Cani Academy of Theater Arts in London, where she honed her acting and singing skills. One of Vinnie's earliest influences was the American actress Lillian Russell. Vinnie admired Russell's beauty, talent, and success in the entertainment industry. She was also inspired by the British actress Sarah Bernhardt, who was known for her powerful stage presence and versatility. Vinnie's path to Hollywood was not without challenges. She faced rejection and discrimination due to her working class background and strong London accent. However, she persevered and eventually caught the attention of Hollywood producers. Once in Hollywood, Vinnie worked with several influential directors and actors, including Alfred Hitchcock and Clark Gable. She also became close friends with actresses Carol Lombard and Myrna Loy. These relationships provided her with valuable support and guidance as she navigated the ups and downs of her career. Throughout her life, Benny remained grateful for the early influences and mentors who inspired her path. She often credited her success to her parents, who instilled in her a love for performing, and to the many talented individuals she met along the way. Benny Barnes was a British-born actress who made a significant impact in Hollywood during the 1930s and 1940s. She appeared in over 60 films, often playing supporting roles in comedies and dramas. Barnes' unique accent and feisty personality made her stand out in Hollywood, and she quickly became a favorite of audiences and critics alike. One of Barnes' most notable contributions to Hollywood was her ability to play a wide range of characters. She could convincingly portray everything from a glamorous socialite to a tough-talking gangster's mall. This versatility made her a valuable asset to any film production, and she was often called upon to play opposite some of the biggest stars of the era, including Clark Gable, Spencer Tracy, and James Stewart. Barnes was also known for her sharp wit and comedic timing. She was a regular performer in the popular Goldwyn Girls musical reviews, where she showcased her singing and dancing skills. Her performances in these reviews helped to establish her as a talented comedian, and she went on to appear in several successful comedies throughout her career. Despite her success in Hollywood, Barnes never forgot her roots. She remained proud of her British heritage and often returned to England to appear in films and stage productions. Her contributions to both the British and American film industries have been recognized with numerous awards and accolades. In conclusion, Benny Barnes was a trailblazing actress who left an indelible mark on Hollywood. Her versatility, wit, and talent made her a beloved figure in the industry, and her contributions continue to be celebrated to this day. 
Benny Barnes, a British actress born in 1903, discovered her passion for acting at a young age. Raised in the slums of London, she found solace in the local theater, where she would watch performances with wide-eyed wonder. At the age of 14, she decided to pursue acting as a career and began performing in small stage productions. Benny's big break came in 1923 when she was cast in a touring production of The Laughing Lady. Her performance caught the attention of a Hollywood agent who offered her a contract with Paramount Pictures. Benny accepted and moved to America, where she would go on to appear in over 100 films throughout her career. Despite facing numerous challenges as a woman in the male-dominated film industry, Benny never lost her passion for acting. She once said, I loved every minute of it, the glamour, the excitement, the chance to play so many different roles. Benny's dedication to her craft and her ability to bring complex characters to life earned her a place as one of Hollywood's most respected actresses. Benny's career spanned several decades, and she worked with some of the biggest names in the industry, including Bing Crosby, Bob Hope, and Spencer Tracy. She was known for her sharp wit and her ability to hold her own against her male co-stars. Benny's passion for acting never waned, even as she grew older. In her later years, she continued to appear in film and television shows, and she even took up painting as a hobby. She once said, acting and painting are very similar. They both require creativity and imagination, and they both allow me to express myself in different ways. Benny Barnes passed away in 1998, but her legacy as a talented and passionate actress lives on. Her story is a testament to the power of following one's dreams and the enduring appeal of the creative arts. Benny Barnes, the Jewish-born English actress, shares a significant connection with Joe E. Brown as they rest together in a large monument at Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Glendale, California. Throughout her career, Barnes had the opportunity to work alongside notable actresses, including Merle Oberon. The two shared the screen in four films, The Private Life of Henry VIII, The Private Life of Don Juan, the divorce of Lady X, until we meet again. Interestingly, when Barnes decided to convert to Catholicism, Loretta Young, her fellow actress, assumed the role of her sponsor and godmother. This conversion marked a significant turning point in Barnes' personal life, with Young playing a pivotal role in the process. Benny Barnes, a talented British actress, faced numerous challenges in her early career. Born in 1903, she grew up in poverty, and had to overcome financial struggles to pursue her dream of acting. Despite her natural talent, she encountered skepticism from industry professionals who doubted her potential. However, Barnes' resilience and determination helped her overcome these obstacles. She started her career on the stage, performing in small theaters, and gradually making a name for herself. To make ends meet, she took on various jobs, including working as a model and a singer. Barnes' big break came when she was discovered by a Hollywood talent scout and offered a contract with a major studio. However, even then, she faced discrimination and prejudice due to her working-class background and strong accent. Undeterred, Barnes continued to work hard and hone her craft. She developed a unique comedic style and became known for her sharp wit and quick thinking. Her talent and versatility helped her land roles in a variety of films, including comedies, dramas, and musicals. Barnes' success in the industry was a testament to her resilience and determination. She proved that with hard work and perseverance, anyone can overcome obstacles and achieve their dreams. Her legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors and actresses today. Benny Barnes, the British actress, had an interesting relationship with Clark Gable, often playing poker with him at the studio, and at his home. She shared the screen with John Carradine in five films, including Gateway and The Three Musketeers. Barnes had a significant stage role as Fanny and Noel Coward's play Cavalcade, but when she was signed by Fox for a different role in the film adaptation, she had a stormy experience. She sailed to New York on the Queen Mary and expected to be taken to the Waldorf Towers, but when no one from the studio met her, she decided to return to Britain the next day. This anecdote showcases Barnes' determination and resilience in the face of unexpected challenges. Benny Barnes, a British actress, had several breakthrough moments in her career. In 1933, she signed a contract with Paramount Pictures, which led to her first significant role in the film A Wicked Woman. This role helped establish her as a talented actress in Hollywood. Later, in 1935, Barnes starred in the film The Man Who Broke the Bank at Monte Carlo, 
where she played opposite Ronald Coleman. Her performance was highly praised, and she gained recognition from both critics and audiences. This role significantly impacted her career and solidified her status as a leading lady. In the late 1930s, Barnes began to take on more diverse roles, showcasing her versatility as an actress. She starred in several successful films, including Service Deluxe and Storm in a Teacup. Her performances in these films were highly regarded, and she became known for her comedic timing and dramatic range. One of Barnes' most significant breakthroughs came in 1940 when she starred in the film Jamaica and directed by Alfred Hitchcock. Although the film received mixed reviews, Barnes' performance was highly praised. This role further solidified her reputation as a talented actress and helped her secure future roles in high-profile productions. Throughout her career, Barnes worked with many notable actors and directors, including Charles Lawton, Clark Gable, and George Cukor. Her collaborators often spoke highly of her talent and professionalism. For example, director George Cukor once said, Benny Barnes was a delight to work with. She had a great sense of humor and was always prepared. Barnes' impact on the film industry is still felt today. Her ability to take on diverse roles and her commitment to her craft have inspired generations of actors. Her legacy as a trailblazing actress continues to resonate with audiences and industry professionals alike. Benny Barnes, the British-born actress, once sued Harry Cohn of Columbia Pictures over a publicity stunt. The lawsuit was regarding a supposed order for Barnes to be photographed in her garters behind a screen, but it was later revealed that it was all a plan concocted by Barnes and Cohn. Throughout her career, Barnes made 26 comedy shorts with Stanley Lupino. Their collaboration was well received and helped establish Barnes' comedic prowess. Furthermore, Barnes had the opportunity to work with Cesar Romero in five films, including Diamond Gem, Rendezvous, Always Goodbye, Wife, Husband, and Friend, and Frontier Marshal. Their on-screen chemistry was undeniable and added to the success of these films. Barnes' career was marked by her versatility and ability to take on various roles, making her a valuable asset in the film industry. Benny Barnes, a British-American actress, was known for her unique approach to her work. She had a naturalistic style, which set her apart from many of her contemporaries who favored a more stage-inspired mode of acting. Barnes believed in getting under the skin of her characters, understanding their motivation and emotions, and portraying them as real people rather than mere caricatures. Her artistic process was deeply intuitive. She would immerse herself in the script, studying her character's line and actions, and then let her instincts guide her performance. This organic approach allowed her to bring a fresh and spontaneous energy to her roles, making her performances compelling and memorable. Benz's personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in her work. Having lived through two world wars and experienced the upheaval of immigration, she brought a depth of understanding and empathy to her characters that was rare for her time. She was not afraid to portray complex, flawed women, and her work often explored themes of resilience, survival, and the human capacity for growth and change. Barnes's unique style and approach to her work have left a lasting impact on the film industry. Her naturalistic acting style helped pave the way for the more realistic performances that are common today and her willingness to take on complex, challenging roles served as an inspiration for future generations of actresses. Despite passing away in 1998, Benny Barnes's legacy continues to resonate, reminding us of the power of authenticity, empathy, and intuition in the artistic process. In a 1973 interview on The Johnny Carson Show, Benny Barnes claimed to be 59 years old, but she was actually 70, as revealed in her biography. Early in her career, she shared a living space with Pat Patterson when both were aspiring actresses in England. These details offer a glimpse into the life of Barnes before she became a well-known figure in the film industry. Benny Barnes was a British-American actress who made her mark in Hollywood during the 1930s and 1940s. She appeared in over 70 films and was known for her comedic timing, vivacious personality, and versatility. Barnes's impact on the industry can be seen in the way she challenged gender norms and expectations of the time. She often played strong-willed and independent women, which was a departure from the more submissive roles that many actresses were relegated to. Her characters were often humorous and sharp-tongued, which made her a fan favorite. Industry experts and those she inspired have commented on her contribution to the industry. 
Film historian Janine Basinger notes that Barnes was a pioneer who helped to pave the way for future generations of actresses to take on more complex and substantial roles. Director Howard Hawks, who worked with Barnes on the film Ball of Fire, described her as a delight to work with and praised her natural talent for comedy. Barnes's influence can also be seen in the way she inspired other actresses. Debbie Reynolds, who was influenced by Barnes's comedic style, once said, Benny Barnes was a comedic genius. She had a way of delivering lines that was just so natural and funny. I always admired her and tried to emulate her in my own performances. In addition to her impact on the industry, Barnes also left a lasting impression on her fans. Her performances were known for their energy, wit, and charm, and she remained a beloved figure in Hollywood long after her retirement. Overall, Benny Barnes's contribution to the film industry cannot be overstated. She was a trailblazer who challenged gender norms, paved the way for future generations of actresses, and left a lasting impact on the industry and her fans. Benny Barnes, born in 1903, had an eventful life before her screen debut in 1929. She worked in various fields including nursing, as a chorus girl, dance hostess, and vaudeville comedian. Contrary to popular belief, her film debut was in 1923's Fauna film, with her next movie released in 1931. Throughout her career, Barnes shared the screen with Rosalind Russell in four films' rendezvous. This thing called Love, The Trouble with Angels, and Where Angels Go Trouble Follows. Benny Barnes was also a mother of three children, Mike Frankovich Jr., Peter Frankovich, and Michelle Frankovich de Mott. In addition, she was the aunt of Rayford Barnes. Barnes' career and personal life were both filled with diverse experiences and connections, leaving a lasting impact on the film industry. Benny Barnes, the British-American actress, led a life full of passion and interests outside of her professional sphere. She was known for her love of art, antiques, and gardening. Barnes's keen eye for beauty was reflected in her acting, as she often chose roles that showcased her versatility and depth as an artist. Beyond her career, Barnes was deeply committed to various philanthropic efforts. She was particularly passionate about animal welfare and actively supported the American Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals. Barnes believed that all living beings deserve compassion and care, and she worked tirelessly to promote this value throughout her life. Barnes's personal values and interests often informed her work as an actress. She was known for choosing roles that aligned with her beliefs and passions, and she used her platform to raise awareness for important social issues. Barnes's dedication to her craft and her commitment to making a positive impact in the world left a lasting legacy that continues to inspire people today. In addition to her philanthropic efforts and acting career, Barnes was also a talented singer and dancer. She often incorporated these skills into her roles, adding an extra layer of depth and artistry to her performances. Barnes's love of music and dance was just one more example of her passion for the arts and her commitment to using her talents to make the world a better place. Overall, Benny Barnes was a multi-talented artist and philanthropist who left a lasting impact on the world. Her personal values and interests informed her work, and she used her platform to make a positive difference in the lives of others. Barnes's legacy continues to inspire people today, reminding us all of the power of art, compassion, and dedication. Benny Barnes, the British-born actress, received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 1960, located at 1501 Vine Street in Hollywood, California. Her contribution to the film industry was recognized and celebrated with this prestigious accolade. In another notable event, Barnes and her husband were laid to rest in Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Glendale, California, alongside the famous comedian and actor Joe E. Brown. This unique arrangement speaks to the close friendship and camaraderie that existed between these Hollywood legends. Barnes' career spanned several decades, and she left an indelible mark on the film industry. Her work continues to be celebrated and appreciated by movie enthusiasts around the world. The legacy she left behind is a testament to her talent, hard work, and dedication to her craft. Throughout her life, Barnes was known for her understated elegance, sharp wit, and undeniable charm. She was a consummate professional who brought a unique energy and enthusiasm to every project she worked on. Her contributions to the world of entertainment will not be forgotten. In the end, Benny Barnes' life and career serve as an inspiration to aspiring actors and actresses everywhere.
Her ability to adapt and thrive in a constantly changing industry is a testament to her resilience and determination. And while she may no longer be with us, her work will continue to live on for generations to come. Vinnie Barnes was a talented actress known for her work in films such as Wuthering Heights and King Solomon's Mines. She had a long and successful career spanning several decades. Her legacy in the industry is one of hard work, dedication, and a true passion for her craft. She was able to take on a wide variety of roles and make each character her own. For those looking to follow in her footsteps, Barnes would likely advise to always be true to yourself and your art. Don't be afraid to take on new challenges and push yourself to try new things. Stay dedicated to your craft and never give up on your dreams. The entertainment industry can be tough, but with hard work and determination, you can achieve your goals. As for the future, Barnes' legacy continues to inspire new generations of actors and actresses. Her work will always be remembered and cherished by those who had the pleasure of seeing her on the big screen. And who knows, perhaps her future contributions will be discovered and appreciated by new audiences as well. In summary, Binnie Barnes was a talented actress who left a lasting impact on the industry. She would advise aspiring professionals to stay true to themselves and their craft and to never give up on their dreams. Her legacy continues to inspire and influence new generations of performers. Minnie Barnes, a British actress born in 1904, experienced a tragic loss early in her life. At the age of 14, a fire destroyed her family's home, claiming the life of her younger sister. This event had a profound impact on Barnes, who later moved to London to pursue a career in acting. Despite the hardships she faced, Barnes built a successful career in Hollywood, appearing in over 60 films throughout her career. Her resilience and determination serve as a testament to her strength and talent. Benny Barnes, a British-American actress, graced the entertainment industry with her talent and passion for over five decades. Born in 1903, she began her career on the stage before transitioning to film in the 1930s. Barnes appeared in more than 100 films, often portraying strong-willed and feisty characters, which set her apart from her contemporaries. Throughout her career, Barnes worked with some of the most prominent figures in Hollywood, including Alfred Hitchcock, Clark Gable, and Bing Crosby. Despite facing numerous challenges, including the shift from silent films to talkies and the rise of new stars, she remained dedicated to her craft and continued to innovate. Barnes's impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable. She broke barriers for women in Hollywood by playing complex and dynamic roles, paving the way for future generations of actresses. Moreover, her ability to adapt to changing times and maintain her relevance in the industry is a testament to her enduring creativity and perseverance. In conclusion, Benny Barnes's journey in the entertainment industry serves as a powerful reminder of the power of creativity and perseverance. Her passion for acting and her willingness to take risks and innovate left an indelible mark on the industry, inspiring generations of actors and filmmakers to come. Barnes's legacy is a testament to the idea that with hard work, dedication, and a little bit of creativity, anyone can make a lasting impact on the world. As fans of classic films, let's take a moment to appreciate the work of the talented actress Benny Barnes. With a career spanning over five decades, Barnes left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Her performances in movies like Whipsaw, Service Deluxe, and The Charge of the Light Brigade showcased her remarkable acting prowess and versatility. Now, we'd love to hear your thoughts on Benny Barnes' work and legacy. What are your favorite Benny Barnes films? How did she inspire you? Share your memories and opinions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this reflection on Barnes' career, please remember to like and share this post with your friends. Let's celebrate the lives and achievements of the creative spirits who have shaped the entertainment world. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content celebrating these remarkable artists. Together, let's keep their memories and contributions alive for future generations to appreciate.